shy and big and real cute. It's time for your dog of the week. Regina Braben of Critical Care for Animal Angels is here to introduce us to Chewy. Okay, not Chewbacca, but I had to do a Star Wars reference for Chewy. C H U Y. Right. Uh, he is so. By the way, that was the worst Chewbacca impression I've ever done. So tell us his story because the poor guy, once you get a close up of him, you'll see tongue sticking out. Tell us about his story. He is a, uh, we think a Chihuahua pug mix. Um, he's come up from Florida. He's a senior dog. He's about seven years old. He's way overweight, as you can see, and we're working on getting his weight down. But he has really bad teeth, so he's got to have some dental work done, and it'll help his breathing and help him feel better. I just feel so bad for him. Is it possible for us to get a, a, a close-up of his face, just because it would be really interesting? See, there's his tooth sticking out, the poor guy. Here's his tongue, and his tongue's always out because he doesn't have teeth to hold it in. And he's shaking a little bit, too, because he's, <laughs> he's nervous. But he's so sweet. I mean, that's the thing. He's sweet. He's shy, but not mean. Doesn't even, I haven't heard him bark or anything this morning. No, Nothing. he's got a very, very quiet bark. Um, and he's happy to sit in your lap, which is part of the weight issue. Um, he is potty pad trained. I'm trying to undo potty pad training. But he'd be great for an older person, anybody in an apartment. Um, he's not one that's going to play ball. He's going to cuddle on the couch. Yeah, so not, uh, not a uh, dog that you think would be best suited for maybe a family with kids. Right, right. right. So stick, stick with the, um, the older folk. And I, I think that'd be great, too. I mean, I think even for just a, I mean, like me as, as a bachelor, I think somebody like me would be maybe perfect really, for him. Yes. really like him. If you don't like to do a lot of work with the dog, <laughs> he <laughs> he's great. It. He is it. I, I was joking with you earlier. He kind of has cat tendencies because a little shy at first, cat has to kind of earn your trust, mm -hmm. and likes to cuddle a lot rather than just running around and, and playing. I mean, a lot of cats run around, but running around and playing at that. So I think definitely there's a certain demographic that'd be best for him. And he's good with the other dogs. Um, he just kind of fits in with the pack. He's, he's not playing really. He's just kind of walking around with them and mm -hmm. Every, everybody seems to be getting along real good. Mm -hmm. but he's, he's super sweet. Yeah. So you would think then, we have about 25 seconds left, you would think then he would get along with maybe other animals too, other dogs, other cats? I, I suspect cats as well, because he's just kind of there. He's all, all right. about where I'm at, what I'm doing. Wonderful. That's no guarantee that your dog or cat will like him, but he will like your dog and cat. Thanks so much for introducing us to Chewy. Thank you. And if you'd like to adopt Chewy or one of the other dogs from Critical Care for Animal Angels, call 293 2066. You can also visit their Facebook page at facebook.com slash critical care for animal angels. And you can also go to their Facebook page to PayPal to help get him the dental work he needs. Thanks again.